If it's possible for a car to have good manners, a Bristol has good manners. Every car we build is built for an owner, and every car is different. The waiting list varies between about a year and 18 months. Some people say it's, it's a test in terms of owning the car to even discover we exist. My name is Ben Samuelson, and here we are in the Bristol Cars showroom, which has been here since the 1950s. At the end of the Second World War, the Bristol Aircraft Company that had built fighters and bombers found themselves with 40,000 people employed, and building high-performance, lightweight, sporting cars seemed like the logical thing to do. Although we only make 150 cars a year, we are unusual in that we have four different models. Three of them are based on our four-seater car Blenheim chassis. Unlike most very expensive cars, the idea of the Blenheim is that it makes no outward statement. We try and keep a mix of the current cars and the used cars. We in fact take an existing donor car and completely rebuild it with all new parts to the same standards, but it effectively becomes a new car. There you have the fascinating combination of a lovely, elegant, classic car with modern conveniences. It takes more than two and a half thousand man hours to build a Bristol. You never have to queue up in a gas station because there's a fuel filler cap on both sides. Just small things like that added to the rest of the engineering integrity makes Bristol really unique. My name is Richard Hackett. I've been at Bristol Cars since 1963. We keep files on every Bristol that we've ever built and the owners that have had them over the years. It's invaluable to keep all the records so that we can build or rebuild cars to original specification. The fighter is actually something many people think is completely new for Bristol. In fact, we made a similar car back in the early 50s. The whole car is designed as a wing. Stepping inside the fighter, you feel the aircraft influence immediately. The interior layout was to some extent based on what you see in uh, aircraft today. Tradition is important to us. We've realized that we do what we do in a narrow niche market very well and have therefore chosen to stay with what we do well. It's a long-term commitment from us to the customer that's part of our appeal.